Hey everybody, what's going on? Thanks for stopping by and digging into the card pile. Today we're going to do a couple little things. I bought one of the infamous Fairfield boxes. And then a quick little uh, mail day mystery surprise from uh, Skip over at Skip's Rips. So we'll see how that goes. So let's tear into this bad boy first. You either love him or hate him or if you're kind of like me, you just got a hankering for him every once in a while. And I messed up and turned it up. I opened it up the wrong side. You'd think I'd know better by now. Uh, that can be said about a lot of things for me, though. I want to be careful. Don't want to damage the, uh, the precious cargo. Oh, some stragglers left in there. Okay, the box is empty. First thing we'll do is see what kind of pack we got here what is this 88 donners or something like that I think so let's rip it open and find out ninety donners okay Gary Templeton Dennis Lamp Jeff Robinson Chris Piolas I don't know Mark Williamson, Kelly Gruber Diamond King, that's pretty cool. Willie McGee card, that's pretty cool. Les Lancaster, Cubbies. Mark Guthrie, Billy Hatcher. Geronimo, Her, Ger let's just say Geronimo or something. Hernan Hernandez. Dan Kramer. Richie Schultz, Dan Shasseter, and the Carl Yastrzemski puzzle piece card. There's the back of it. Let me show you uh, real quick the back of the regular base ones. Another former Cubby right there. We'll do the Les Lancaster, the Kelly Gruber, the Willie McGee. We already showed the back and Gary Templeton and the back of the Yastrzemski card. $19.90. Alright, so here's the backs of uh, a couple of these $90. No big hit crazy wise in the pack. But a couple little good ones. These are the backs. There's the back of the Diamond King for Kelly Gruber. But yeah, fairly decent. All right, let's get into the meat of the box. They usually have them all scrambled and backwards and all that good stuff. So let's see what we can pull off here. Jose Hernandez, Rolando Vieira, Josh Edgen, Paul DeLong. Rich Thompson, Tyler Glasgow, what is up with this front right here, you see that, I don't know what the heck that is, that's pretty wild, set that over there because I have no idea. These are all a couple backwards. Neil Allen, Evan Carter rookie card, Andrew Vaughn, Juan Gonzalez uh, collector's choice checklist. That's a pretty cool looking card for that. Roberto Alomar, BJ Surhoff, Tony Pena, George Brett. The triple play cards. That's pretty cool right there. Crazy. Then we have Dave Smith, Bob Welch, Tommy Green, Pat Lennon, Tom Needenpure, Mike Lloyd. Another Tom Needenpure. There we go. Cool.
cool glove. Kind of reminds me of uh, Daryl Strawberry's glove back in the day. When he was with the Mets. Shawan Dunstan. Joe Oliver. Johnny Grubb. Kirk Gibson. That's a cool shot. Kind of. You, know, you can take this shot a couple different ways. It's pretty funny. You know, let, let it soak it in for a minute. At Lee Hamaker. Rob Deere. Billy Hatcher. Seal Campesano. Trevor Wilson. Darren Jackson. Lance McClure's. Eric Davis. Tim Spear. Matt Noakes. Bob Owenchinko. Mike Heath. Jim Leland with no Siggy. Mark Salis. Dave West. Dean Palmer. Eric Karos. Alex Sanchez. And the last one. Oil Cam Boyd. Pretty cool. Few hits in there. Minor. Sub minor. Something I would dig. Like the Oil Cam Boyd. Uh, the Dunstan cards. The Dunstan card. Juan Gone. The Evan Carter rookie. I mean, whatever that is. I mean, I know it's his foot, but it looks like... Ah, it just, just looks weird. It being the shoe and all threw me off. Anyway, that was the uh, infamous Fairfield box. Not so much great in there, but they're always worth a shot. You know, they're a couple bucks. So let's get into this. This is from old Skip over at Skip's Rips on YouTube, and he's on Facebook. He runs the uh, fifty and dollar under sports cards. So I'll. Uh, Leave a link to uh, both his page and the uh, the channel in the description. All right, we got a two-parter here. That's a sweet look in tops now, Josh Gibson. I think I commented on uh, one of his posts about this card. And then what else? Let's see. Let's see the back of this. Talks about him hitting the home runs and a bunch of his other stats. It's a pretty sweet looking card right there. That is pretty nice. And uh, all he knows I dig stamps. And I think he... Yeah, those are pretty cool right there. That is pretty old. Looking, I think he told me. Um, I can't remember what year he said, but anyway, these are pretty cool. He knows I dig stamps, and uh, those are pretty cool. I appreciate it, Skip. Thanks a lot. And I know you so told me in a text what the year was, and I just spaced it. Typical me, but anyway, those are real cool. Those will go right with my other stamps. A little three strip, I love it. All connected. In the back. Here, let's take them out real quick. Well, maybe not. But I do want to do one thing. Hold on. Sorry about that, folks. I know this is going to sound crazy and odd, but I had to pull them out so I could smell them a little bit. I like the smell of old cards, old stamps, anything like that. If there's a chance, yeah. It's weird, I know, but I like to smell them. 
insert joke here. But anyway, those are two pretty cool cards, little items, stamps in the card. That is a cool Josh Gibson card. Got the Grays logo right there. I like that. That's just a cool looking shot right there. And again, the stamps, and I'll zoom in a little bit more. Ah, 1939. So I'll say 1939. I think that's what he said in the text, but I'm going to go with 1939. But yeah, those are pretty cool. So again, thanks, Skip. I appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Kind of wacky, kind of silly. Uh, the Fairfield boxes are always just, ah, you never know. But the gifts were awesome right there. Definitely going to put these in the stamp collection. And then the uh, have a box full of modern vintage players, modern vintage stars. This will go right in there with uh, probably one of my most favorite modern vintage player cards. Uh, I think it was 2016 Upper Deck Willie Mays. Where he's staring down the barrel of a bat. If you get a chance, check that card out. I did. I think I did a video or a short or something like that of that card. It's a really cool card for it being a modern card. It's just a, one of the best photos I've seen on a card. It's just super awesome. If it was, if it was a vintage card. It would probably be one of the most popular cards out there. It's that cool of a card. Alright, so go back into my videos. Check that out somewhere. Willie Mays, 2000 something. And it was from Stadium Club, I believe. So yeah, this will go right there with it. Thanks, Skip. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give this video a uh, thumbs up. I appreciate you watching. And if you haven't subscribed yet, Please click that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate that. And to everyone that already is subscribed, love you all. Thanks a lot. Have a good one.